welcome. Thanks for joining us. Triple-A action coming at you on the show. It's the Nashville Sounds taking on the Worcester Red Sox. First pitch coming your way next. All right, ready to get underway. And now Pablo Reyes. Sale delivers. That one finds a corner. It's a ball and two strikes. Sale in a one-two. Late swing, fouled off. And sale deals. Just missed. Really good take, especially with two strikes. In the air, center field. A little bloop single. So a runner aboard to start the inning. When you flare a ball out behind second base, it's really a tough spot for anyone to get to. And you're never trying to do that as a hitter. But when you do, I tell you what, you're yelling at it the entire way to get down. And now, Abraham Almonte. Next offering is foul back. Sale ready. Hit in the air, right field. Number 49 has a beat on it, and there's one down. This is Bryce Terang. Batting third, the shortstop, Bryce Terang. Next offering misses, two and one. Always tough to turn two on a speedster like this. It's even harder with him coming out of the left-handed batter's box. You really need something to hit hard on the ground that they can handle to turn two quickly. Reyes over at first with one away. Oh, that drilled him. Safe at first, and now after the play, we'll check on the lefty status. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. And now here is Thomas Dillard. Two on, one out. And that bunt goes foul. It's a strikeout. Here's Luis Arias. And here's a 3-2. Bounced up the middle. On to first. And that is that. Bottom of the first. And now Jeter Downs. Two two now. That one missing inside. And there's a base hit at the left. Around first, digging for two. And he's got a leadoff double. Well, oh, that'll make you feel good as a hitter right there. Nice line drive to the pull side, met it out front, but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield. Now batting Jaron Duran. Next offering is foul back. The pitch. Next offering is outside. Comes a 2-2. And now it's filled up. And the pitch. Got him looking. One away. Now batting Tristan Casas. The third baseman, Tristan. Here's a 1-1. And there's a ball. One out and a runner at second. Next offering is down low. And there's
Bears fall forward. Now, this was a story we were paying attention to before the game. We've seen him give up walks in the past, and it's an issue once again early on. First and second, one out. Number 49, the next to hit. Line drive, that's a base hit out of the left center field. Downs around third. Urias with a relay throw, not in time, he scores. And it's 1-0. Well done, drives in the run. Solid swing from start to end. On time with everything, really good balance, nice extension. And he met it out front for the line He's drive knock. Runners. runners on the move. Swing and a miss. And the throw, he's out at third. Kicks and fires. Fly ball to right. And that'll get down for a hit. Here's the throw to the plate. It's offline, and he scores. It's 2 nothing. Picks himself up in RBI. With the way defenders track down balls these days, I mean, both from the infield and in the outfield, there really aren't a lot of base hits on balls hit like that. But there's always a little room back behind the first and second baseman to drop a lawn dart in there, and he found a way. 1-2 now. Ripped on the ground a second. They take the force out, and that is that. set for the start of the inning. Now it's the DH, David Dahl. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. One down. So digging in, Mark Mathias. The second baseman, Mark Mathias. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. And now the center fielder, Corey Ray. The next pitch misses three and one. Left hand batter waits. That's in there. That is strike two. Helpful. To the right side. And that one handled. Whips it to first. Third out. half of inning number two. Now it's Franchi Cordero. Three balls, two strikes the count. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. The three-two is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch, and I tell you what, he earned that walk. At the play, number 51. Swings and pulls it foul to the right side. Saying he wasn't very sharp in the first, got hit around a little bit, just wasn't able to locate particularly well. A lot of stuff for the fat part of the plate. Yeah, Boog, he wasn't fooling anyone. It's a tough place to be because it's not always obvious what adjustments need to be made. Sometimes it's location, sometimes it's being too predictable. Sometimes you're tipping your pitches. He's going to need to figure it out quickly, though. And a pitch. On the ground. Matthias collects it. Fires over to first. Two down. So up next, Jeter Downs doubled his first time up. Cordero on third with two out. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one go right by you. That misses. Two and two. And 
And that's down and away. Here's a high fly ball out to center. Ray gets under it, brings it in, and that'll do it. Welcome back. And now, Brett Sullivan. And now the lefty. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Makes the grab, one away. Back to the top of the lineup. Pablo Reyes stands in. Picked up a base hit to center his first time up. One and two now, Sale. Foul ball there. Swings and misses. And how about Chris Sale locked in now? Two outs, base is empty. Now the number two hitter, Abraham Almonte. And a pitch. Popped in the air, left field. And makes the play, and that's out number three. Back here at the ballpark. Yeah, the batter now, Jaron Duran. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. So now one and two. That's inside. Next pitch is popped up. Makes the catch for the out. Now the third baseman, Tristan Casas, worked a walk in his first trip to the plate. One down, base is empty. Stays alive. Kicks and deals. And that one is lifted in the air. Ray coming in on it. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint. And there's two away. And next will be the cleanup hitter. Number 49. Next one misses. And a count two and one. Good eye right there. The wide to kick the pitch. 3-1, and he couldn't come up with it. Well, that's a really good take right there, and that's just mentally prepared, knowing that if it's not on a tee, you're going to take that pitch because you still have one more strike to work with. Not easy to lay off, but he did an excellent job in that plate appearance. Cut on and missed. Struck him out, and the inning is over. And welcome back. New inning getting started. Now, Bryce Terang. The next offering misses. Now two balls and a strike. And he deals. I got to count two and two. That's off the mark. And that's ball three. Now in this three ball count, down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take your walk if they'll give it to you. The wind and the pitch. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. And that's the first out. And here's the first baseman, Thomas Dillard. Next offering is fouled back. Pitch misses inside, and it's two and two. The 
the big left. He turns, kicks, deals. In the air, right side of the infield. Number 27 settles under it, and he makes the catch. Two up, two down. Man, he just couldn't lay off right there. Those high fastballs, they just look really good because they're eye level, but they're just about impossible to get the barrel to. Chris Sale looking for that shutdown inning. Got him. That ends the frame. Ready to go, bottom four. And now the first baseman, number 27. 2-2. Two -two. Hit hard, that gets through. Couldn't get any air under it, but he smoked that ball back up the middle. Timing was just perfect, got great wood on it, and there was just no chance for the infielders with how hard he hit it. Now, here is Franchi Cordero. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And a ball and two strikes. That one fouled off. The punch out there, and there's one away. Here's the second baseman, number 51. The belt and fires. Stays alive. Number 27 leads off first with one away. Slap the other way. Foul. Tough take right there. He swings at that more often than not. Up the middle, and there's a base hit. Ray to third. In there safely. Nice at bat right there. Not just the result, but also seeing a lot of pitches. Made him really work out there on the mound. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield. And down on strikes he goes. Two away. Jeter downs to the plate here. If he can get through this one, put up a zero, this will help in his outings to come. In the air, out towards left center, drops into the glove, and that's the inning. We go to the top of the fifth. David Dahl to the plate. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. Casas makes the play, and there's one down. Well, that was a pitch you got to crush. Unbelievable that he missed it right there, and I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrating with himself until his next at-bat. The 1-1. One, one. And that one fouled off. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at-bat. On the ground to the left. And he grabs it. Foul. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two out. Two out. Space is empty. Here's the center fielder, Corey Ray. He's over one. Two outs. Line drive, and that should be extra bases. And that's going to get into the corner. And that's a double. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. When you connect and it jumps off your bat like that, you're thinking double at the very least. Put a great swing on it, and man, he wasn't fooled at all. And the batter now, Brett Sullivan. And a swing and a miss. And that's that.
A new pitcher in the game, Jason Alexander. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. We head to the bottom of the fifth, and now here's a speed threat. Outfielder, Jaron Duran. Next pitch is outside. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a broken bat flare. Bare hand has to hurry. And that's a great play for the out. Next to hit, Tristan Casas. Next offering is in for a strike. We got a full count. Three, two. Fouled off. He was late. Some real good life going through the zone on that one. This ball's chopped on the ground. Throws to first. Oh. Home after the fifth inning, moving along. Two quick outs. And now the right fielder, number 49. Ball to strike. And a pop-up, right side, foul territory. Pulls it in on the run. And that'll do it. Top of the sixth inning. Now the left fielder, Pablo Reyes. pitch has popped up Casas moving under it squeezes it and there's one down now with the plate now Abraham back. Almonte a switch hitter batting right ripped on a line can't get their base hit makes the turn and heads for second not stopping, he's going for three. The relay, and the throws offline, safe at third. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. They call those the alleys for a reason, man. They're long, and if you can't cut the ball off as an outfielder before it gets by you, that Whoa, hitter's gonna right run there. for a while. That right there is a beautiful swing and nice hustle for the triple. Next pitch misses, and now three and one. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. Three one count, be ready to turn on a fastball. Swing and a miss, and it's a full count now. And it really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Downs makes the catch. That's out number two. Two outs with a runner at third. This guy's seen two change-ups in a row. He'll be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. Next one off the plate inside. And yeah, that's ball two. And here it comes. Popped up to the left. Into foul ground. And that's the third out. Bottom of the sixth inning, and now it's Hudson Potts. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. And the righty deals. And now two and two. And now it's three and two. Right-handed reliever. Lined, and that's a base hit. 
nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Here goes the runner. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. Oh, he dropped it. Throw comes in. Runner stopped. Second and third. Nobody out. So digging in, Franchi Cordero. A strikeout and a walk. And the right hander deals. And a count one and two. Number 36, the runner at third. Number 27 stands at second. No outs. Next pitch misses outside. Now two and two. Got him. And that's the first out. Number 51 now at the plate. Well, he's so good about trying to drive the ball to the opposite field gap in these situations. If he takes that approach, he could bust this game wide open. Smash to the left side. And that's going to be a double, and it'll score two. One run is in. Another comes in to score, and it's 4 nothing. A two-run double. Gets the job done as he brings home a pair. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Now it's Ronaldo Hernandez. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. And there's two down. So the batting order turns over. Digging in, Jeter Downs. Runner at second, two down. Chases in the dirt, slider there. In time, the 2 3 strikeout ends the inning. Welcome back. Now, here is Luis Urias. And a foul ball. That one lifted to left. Cordero in position. Puts the squeeze on it. And there's one down. Good pitch. He just kind of had him out in front on that pitch away and wasn't able to stay close. Next is the designated hitter, David Dahl. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. Two balls, one strike, they count. The wind of the pitch. Good eye right there. A rare three ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. Fouls one away, and now three and two. Four. He missed down low. Well, he's starting to look a little gassed to me, and we'll see if they go to the bullpen in this spot or not. Next to hit, Mark Mathias, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. One and two now. Sail back to work. In the air, left field. Makes the grab for the second out. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. So two on with two away. Brett Sullivan getting ready to hit. Two on, two outs. Out to short. Downs. Picks it up. They get the force. And that is the third out of the inning.
set for the last half of the seventh. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Jaron Duran. The pitch. That one ran inside, almost got him. He should get a pretty good pitch to hit here with the three-hole hitter coming up if he's walked. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Boog, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Ripped to third and caught. And now it's going to be number 49. Number 49. Duran, at first, one gone. Swing and a ball popped up. Urias makes the grab. And there's two down. So two down now. And here is now Hudson Potts. Hudson. And there's a foul ball. 2-2. Two -two. Hammered on a line to the left, base hit. Throw in, holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. Now on the bump, Thomas Jenkins. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. Now pitching for number 64, Thomas Jenkins. So up next, number 27. 1-1 one, one now. And a foul ball. Here comes a pitch. First and second, two down. Next pitch is outside. Right-hander kicks, deals. Ground ball, left side. Urias to first in time. Out number three. Derek Holland takes over on the mound. Trying to protect this lead. here at the ballpark ready to begin the eighth leading off Pablo Reyes next offering is fouled back and that one in the air center field nice grab on the run and there's one down Now it's the right fielder, Abraham Almonte. And a pitch. And down on strikes. And there are two down. Bryce Terang digs in now. Next pitch is inside. Three and one. Left-hand hitter waits. Fought off foul. Here comes a 3-2. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. That's his second strikeout. Bottom of the eighth. Here's the left fielder, Franchi Cordero. And a pitch. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Righty to the plate. 
And he hits a ground ball right side. Takes it himself. And that's one away as the leadoff man is out in the eighth. And here is number 51. Next offering is in for a strike. The pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Next pitch is downstairs. Righty delivers. And now the count filled up three and two. And that's awfully close. I don't know how you take that. He's seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand really well right now. Stays alive. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Ninth pitch of the at bat due next. And there's a fly ball deep right field. Way back. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. He'll circle the bases, and they add to their lead. It's five zip. And now the catcher comes up to him. Ronaldo Hernandez. Next offering upstairs. Two balls, one strike. The pitch. On the ground, right side. Matthias collects to first, and that's an out. And now the shortstop, Jeter Downs. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. In the air, left field, down the line. Makes the grab on the run. And that ends the inning. We go to the ninth, and here is Thomas Dillard. And a pitch. Hey. And it's even up. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. One out. Luis Urias will hit next. The lefty ready and a 1-1. Good eye in that spot. Kicks and fires. Strike two. And he deals. Swing and a bouncer. Over to first. Now only one out remaining. Two outs, base is empty. And next is the designated hitter, David Dahl. Here's a one-two. Foul ball, he stays alive. There's a swing and a drive. That's back there. Dives, but it falls. And now it looks like extra bases. Dahl into second, and he's got a double. Gotta love the resiliency he showed in that at bat, battling with two strikes. Put a pretty good jolt into that one. Great swing, nice balance and weight transfer, and he got it to drop in out there in the deep part of the field. Next offering is in for a strike. High fly ball out to center field. Duran under this one. That's the ball game. Whether you're a season ticket holder or you just come to a couple of games a year, to see your team win at home, there's just something special about that. Good job by these guys to get it done for the hometown fans. 5-0 the final in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long.
five runs, ten hits, no errors. They left eight men on base. For the Sam, no runners, five hits, no errors. They left seven men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 46 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please drive home safely.